holes in it because I didn't, I think it's a pure cotton. Mm -hmm. And it might have been in the dryer just to hit here too long. Yeah, right Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today was a different day for me. It's cold outside, so I didn't I went out to give the chickens their scratch, but I didn't stay out there very long because it was cold. Honey Boo Boo ate out of my hand and Mr. Brown ate out of the dish and then I'd say, Okay, I'm all done and he seems to understand the word all done because he hops down, he knows I'm gonna throw the rest of the scratch and he goes to get it. Today, Silver was sitting on no eggs for a little while and Dorothy had all the eggs. Then I went to look at see what they were doing and Dorothy had moved herself to a different spot and she was on a bunch of different eggs. So I took those eggs out and gave her her eggs back, which were getting colder. So I hope that they weren't too cold because it's cold out today. And I gave Silver the other two eggs because Silver's got the blue eggs and Dorothy's got the brown eggs. They're a little bit different. And I've got them marked so that I know that those are the eggs that I'm supposed to keep under the girls. Today, I got a comment in my comments that kind of pushed me to where I was thinking the same thing. I've been, you know, I've been struggling with my leg giving me difficulty. It's, it's like, it's a weird leg. It's odd. Oh, that's the wrong side. No wonder. Okay. I didn't even know that was on the back. Oh. oh. My smoking status. I don't smoke. <laughs> oh, it's got more information about me, but I don't smoke. Patient has never smoked. Oh, that's true. And then it's got, of course, about the, the virus that's in the air. They have a little thing on that. I went to the I went to the doctor today. I was reading Debbie Center Center's suggestion. And she suggested that I go to the doctor, and I'd been thinking about it. Last night, I actually propped my leg up on a pillow because you're supposed to wake up and you're you're supposed to have skinny legs and skinny feet. Mm -hmm. Whereas I wake up and mine are I've got swollen legs and swollen a uh, swollen leg and a swollen foot. And then as the day goes on, the shoe gets looser. And I said to Jim, "This is not." the way it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be loose in the morning and by night you should have the swelling. So I went to the doctor and they did two tests. Well, they did three things. They took my blood and the reason they took my blood is he said that sometimes there's something in the blood that might show up that won't show up in the x-ray. They also took a regular x-ray of my knee and they did a sonogram type x-ray. Sonogram where they put the gel on and they, they wanted to check to see if there was any blood clots. Apparently, they didn't see anything so far that I know of. I will get my results back probably before the week is up, I would imagine. He will, I'm sure, will get a hold of me. Because today, when I went to the doctor, he said that I should just go over to the lab and get the blood work. And it didn't have to be fasting blood work. And I got my blood work done, and then I went over to the hospital to drop off the paper that I was supposed to drop off to get the x-rays. And they said that they could do the x-ray today because there was nobody in the waiting room. And then she said, well, this other one you'd probably have to schedule. And, I, and she wanted to schedule it, and she goes, which is better, morning or night? And I says, well, anytime, tomorrow. And then I said, even today? And she says, hmm, let me check. And so she looked to see, and the lady didn't have anything for the afternoon. So I got both tests done today, plus the blood work. So I'm good. I've got everything done. And that's great, because tomorrow they're telling us we're supposed to get snow again. Don't want snow. We won't get any accumulation. But it's but cold. It's, be nasty. it's really cold. It, we didn't get any rain today, but we did get rain last night. It rained a lot last night, and the, gra the ground was soggy in areas this morning. The chickens were out and about and they were having a good time walking out and about. In fact, they went in the front yard, the middle section of the front yard, and they were scratching under Jim's tree. And I said, well, they're scratching for bugs under there. I don't know if it's going to ruin it or make it better. Yeah, I have no idea. You've got the wood chips there. You'll have to put more wood chips there when it yep. comes time. And I hope they don't bother the wood chips. But if they do, we'll just mm -hmm. put them back. Yep. I guess that's everything. Oh, I have a little video I want to put in. 
let's go to that I put my eggs out today and I'm going to show you how I did it today That little cart works really good. I don't know if the egg sold or not yet today because we haven't brought the cart back in. I told Jim he could bring it back in. It's not that hard. He can bring the signs and the cart back in. I don't want to go outside because it's cold. He's going to go out for me. It's not cold. It's, it's nice. cold. It's cold. I, I'd have to put my earmuffs on. I would probably put gloves on. I would put a heavier jacket on. It's cold. We have a lot of wind here. And the wind is blowing pretty good, and, and it feels bitter cold. And he's going to have to go get my eggs, so we have to say goodbye. I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.